Tina Asa. Hey, where is Tina Asa? Oh. Tina Asa, you have to come. The worst has happened, Tina Asa. The worst. What is it now? What happened? But it's about your father, Tina Asa. You, it seems he was having um, issues with his landlord. The, the man threw him out the shop and seized his goods. And your father collapsed. Oh, Tina, where is mama? Mama, don't call mama now. Mama is not feeling too well. My father collapsed. Where is he now? Tina, sir. Is he, is he okay? Where is he? Now? I don't know, Tina, sir. I, 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 I had to come so I can inform you and mama. He was taken to one, one hospital. I don't I even know. Mama, mama. Mama, no, hey. mama, mama, come on. Hey. Tina, oh, sir, give me. Tina, sir. Do you want to give your mother a heart attack? Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm going to be said, Papa. Papa collapsed. Go, eh, eh, go. Eh, eh. Hey! Okay, what hospital? Two Mama. Hospital? Yes, Mama, take it easy. Hey! Take it to what hospital? Don't know. Let's go and look Mama, for the hospital. Mama, 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 Fonso, Fonso, what happened? Doctor, doctor, please, I'm begging you in God's name. Please admit my husband. Admit my husband, doctor. I, I, I cross my heart. Hmm? I am going to do whatever to raise money to pay that 20,000 Naya deposit. And even more because of the treatment. This is a hospital policy. Alright? I cannot admit your husband. Your husband. Okay, you pay this sum of 20,000 naira. That was it. Hey! Doctor! You want to tell me that you watch my husband die in my hands? Because of 20,000 naira, doctor. Because of 20,000 naira, because of work. Hey! What is happening? God! It's hard. 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 Is my dad's life not worth more than your 20,000 naira? How can you be so wicked? Come on, listen, young lady. Could you please watch your tongue, okay? <laughs> we don't run charity organization here, all right? I told you time without number, and there's nothing I can do about this whole thing. I'm admitting every sick, penniless people here. I mean, this hospital will shut down. But doctor, the man's condition is, is critical. We don't even know if he has stroke or something worse, doctor. Please, at least, at least that ordinary first aid on him to save his life, doctor! Well, I can see that you people are bent wasting my time. I think I have other patients to attend to, okay? Are you sure? Get the 20,000 naira when you're ready, you let me know. Hey! Excuse me. I'm not getting it! I'm not getting it! Because of twenty thousand naira, Jim. God, what have I done? Mama, mama, mama is okay. God, what have I done? What have I done? Mama is okay. Mama is okay. Papa is not going to die. Mama, mama, I'm coming. Okay. Thank you very much, Pastor. I'll be leaving now. Oh, may God continue to bless you, Madam Hero. Bless you too. Please, when you get home, extend my regards to your son, Cletus. Mm? You're here. Tell him I am continually in prayers for him. Ah, and that our you. good God will continue to bless him for his good donations to the church. Thank you very much. That's Once lovely. again, ma, God continually reward you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Pastor, please, I need your help. Pastor, please. Pastor, you need to help me. Pastor, please. Pastor, please. Pastor, Baba is dying, you know. Just calm down and tell me what the problem is. Okay, Pastor. Papa collapsed and they rushed him to the hospital. The doctors refused to touch him unless we make a deposit of 20,000 naira. Pastor, we don't even know if he's dead or alive. Pastor. Chinata, I've told you to stop confessing negatively. Nothing will happen to Marzia Alphonse. Mm -hmm. But which doctor will be so callous? That's so cruel of him. Yes. Which hospital is that? 
the one near the village market and one goes to the market. Also, wait, wait, wait. Come down. Listen, oh. if they ask for 20,000 naira deposit, which means the final bill may be like 10 times that amount. Okay. Yes, ma, yes, ma. It's okay. Also, it's okay. Come, get into the car. Let's go and let me know the hospital. Let's go. Thank you, ma. God bless you, madam. That's Mario. nothing. Let us go. Let's go. Uh, That's my car. Enter. Door. I'm coming now. Thank you, and it will be enough for this thing you have done for us. It's okay. God, you continue to bless me. Amen. Thank you. Okay. Uh -uh. For the 20,000 naira yeah. deposit. God bless you, ma'am. God continue to bless you. You don't need to bother yourself. 20,000 naira is nothing to me. I'm glad I'm, I, I'm of help. You know? It doesn't really matter. Don't worry. But, but I must confess, Madam Vero. Yes. <laughs> your generosity confounds me. You and your family never cease to amaze me. And I know that this good God whom we serve will cause men to give unto your bosom. They shall give you and you shall receive good measure, pressed down, shaken together, until they run it over in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Pastor, amen. amen. Thank you very much. <laughs> no problem. I'll be taking my leave now. Yes, before I go, I want to let you know that I have instructed the doctor to send your husband's discharge bill to my office. Eh? You don't need to bother yourself at all. Madame, you did that? Of course, yes. Hey, Madame Veru. No, they should send the bill to me to my office, okay? Ah, now I know that God sent you to come and wipe my tears. Yes. Hey, Madame Veru. Okay. For all these things you've been doing for us, Madame you are an angel in this guy. Okay. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Madam. Thank you. Thank you. It shall be well with you. Amen. Morning, afternoon, night. Amen. Thank you. It shall be well with you. Don't worry. Anything you need, eh? Tinasa, she'll come and tell me. Eh? No problem. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very Thank much, Pastor. Madam, hey, Pastor, please, please help, help me and thank her. Uh, help me and thank her. Don't take it so much. There you are. I was rushing to come and see you at home. Hmm. You almost missed me because I'm going to go and give my papa. Oh, I see. How is your father? He's fine. He's he's doing better. This one, your face is like this. No, it's fine. It, you know, uh, I've been thinking, eh? Okay. If we had paid that twenty thousand in time, I don't think he would have had this. Sincerely speaking, each time I remember that particular incident, I feel f frustrated. I feel like less of a man that I couldn't provide just 20,000 naira to, to save your father's life. Moby, you can't possibly do anything for us. You've tried now. <sighs> eh? Besides, 20,000 is not just, it's a big money. Umwa, it's ordinary to some people. And I am going to be one of those people one day, very soon. I hope that one day comes very soon. <laughs> it's really low, uh, so I can come and 
pay your bride price and whisk you from <laughs> here, you mean, right? <laughs> Whatever. I have to go now. I have to go. Hey, I will, I will walk you so I can buy some fruits for Mama. At least, the least I can do. Eh? Let's, let's go. My love, please uh, help me give this first to Mama. I could have come to the hospital to see her, but I got a new messenger job at uh, that new building. So it's okay. I'll she will understand. It. It's fine. Okay, she will, right? Of course. Now you can come and see Papa when they discharge him from the hospital. Yes, of course. I have to come. Okay, uh, take it. Let me let me walk you some more before. That's how you say you want to walk me. Want to walk me? Walk me to the hospital on on so get to go. Just now. Is that how I used to do? <laughs> You say, let me walk you, let me walk you, let me walk you. You get let to the hospital. Let me walk you. Oh, yeah, walk me. Don't <laughs> you get to the hospital. Ah! Hey. That's Madame Vero. That's Madame Vero. Hey, hey, she's the one. She's the one. Good afternoon, ma'am. I think that's all right. Yes, ma'am. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon. How is your father doing? He's fine. Thank you, ma'am. I'm on my way to the hospital to give him food. Oh, really? Yes, ma'am. Ah, tell your mother that I'm pretty busy these days. I'll definitely be at the hospital the day of your father's discharge. Thank you so much, ma. Thank you for everything, ma. It's all okay. right. It's May all God right. continue to bless you, ma. No thanks needed at all. I know charity work and I like to uh, affect the lives of the less privileged. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, goodbye. Yes, ma. Bye, bye, ma. Why less privileged? Eh, because she, she lost to help less privileged ones now. Nasa, that one is too heavy. That one is too heavy, Joe. She just loves to help less privileged people. That's that's her calling. She wants to open your mouth. Open your mouth now. She wants to open your mouth. was affected. Tell me, how is he going to make it with such, with such attack? How? Mama, he's going to make it. Mama, <sighs> even if the doctors, they fail us, God Almighty will never fail us. God will heal him. I'm here, I'm here, that is what I want. Madam, <laughs> Ma, Madam Vera. Good afternoon, Mom. Yes, sir. Madam Vera, how are you? Yeah, how are you doing today? Oh, we are fine. We are just doing as bad as God wants us to do. Mama, why are you saying that now? Eh? Okay. I've told you before. God Almighty will never put anyone in a bad situation. Mm -hmm. eh? He's going to heal Papa. That's good. That's a very wonderful advice from your daughter. Please listen to your daughter, okay? Okay. Okay, let me continue looking unto God now. Mm -hmm. I heard the other people will soon be discharged. Yes. Mm -hmm. That was what the doctor said. Yes, I know it. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I have offset your bill already. Eh? Yes. You but, have? Of course, yes. Oh my that, God. that is nothing. Madame Vero, you have paid our debt. <laughs> There's nothing to it. Madame Vero, thank you very much. No, 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 thank no, no. you. There's God to will me. meet you at every point of your needs. Thank eh? you. Thank you very eh? much. Whatever you need, God is going to provide it. No, that's okay. Thank you very much. Well, I, don't, I don't know why, why, you're, why you've chosen to help us like this. It's okay. It's okay. See, I'm a very generous person. I love to bless humanity. 
just like God has already blessed me, you know. Hey. It's okay. In fact, when you go home, I will still bring something for you to hold on to. Hey. Mm, so you won't have any problem at all. Hey. Hey. It's, okay. Okay. it's okay. It's okay. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. God will bless you. <laughs> God will continue to. It's okay. <laughs> It's all right. I was actually passing by and I said, let me pop in and see how you feel like doing. <laughs> <laughs> let, let me see how. Let me see you. Okay. okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. In case you need anything. Go ahead, take it. <laughs> but this is too much now. There's nothing to replace. Mama, what, what have we done to deserve this, please? Nothing, nothing. Just help me tell your mother that she should seek for me anytime they need my help. Thank you very much, Mama. No, 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 no. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mama. No, it's okay. It's okay, eh? God bless you, Mama. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Oh. Uh, please, that boy I saw you with in the village. Will you show me him? Um, that should be a movie. Maybe, probably. Uh, who is he to you? Well, <laughs> he's my very good friend. Oh. Okay, no problem. Yes, ma. Send me one to your parents. Okay, please. ma. Thank you very much. God bless you, man. Take care of everything. Yes, man. Yes, Isn't it? Papa is not getting better. Do you know, each and every day, we just pray for a miracle to happen. But miracle don't happen to people like us. Come on. You see that, eh? God is not partial. He will surely heal your father. I hope I'm praying so because at this point now, it is only a miracle that will save Papa, and nothing else. Mm. But have you tried the native herbal treatment? That ought to be cheaper now. Cheaper how? Mm -hmm. The last place we consulted, they charged us 200,000 naira. Where do we get such an amount of money from? But that's too expensive. That's expensive now. Yeah. And a bit change is something. How is Amelia's stuff? If you are considering him, he told me that he wants to marry isn't it? But you and I know that Amobi is not ready for marriage. At least financially. Eh? And I'm not ready to put the burden of my family on his head. Because once we get married, that is what will happen. Are you trying to tell me that you've changed your mind concerning Amobi, my friend? Eh? And so shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 <laughs> it is well. It is well. Thank you very thank much. You, Pastor. Pastor, I thank you so much for finding time to come and visit us. Oh, thank you. Oh, Mama. Eh? I'm only doing the Lord's work. To Him alone be all the praises. Eh? Amen. Amen. Pastor, you don't know how, how relaxed I am now. Now that you have come to help us pray for my husband. I know that this collective prayer is going to heal him. Of course, of course. Eh? Um, Mama. No, no. I have something here for you from Madame Vero. Hmm? Yes. Chimo! Nasa! Huh? He's burning! It's money again, oh! This woman is still giving us money. Mm. Pastor, so, so after everything she has done for us, she's still giving us money. Mm. Mama, I don't believe this, so. Oh. I can't believe it, too. Hey, look at me. Look at Ojageri, thinking about how to get the money for the next meal. Now, please, Pastor, please thank this woman for me. Thank her for me. 
She's an angel in disguise. God will bless her generous soul. Amen. It is well. Um, Mama, I, you take care of him, eh? I have to take my leave now. Uh, <laughs> Pastor, she says offer you something now, even if it is a drink. <laughs> oh no, not to bother at all, eh? Not to bother. Thank you very much. Eh? Uh, Pastor Biko, oh, please. Uh, we, we should have done this long ago. It's just that we didn't have the world without to do it. But now we can. Hey, Pastor, at least a bottle of malt can Mama, do. Mama, I understand. Eh? But no, thank you. I don't want a drink right now, okay? Mm. Mm. Okay. Um, you say so. Let, let me take see. care of him. Mm. Uh, Mama, huh? I would like to discuss something with you. Just walk with me to my car. Uh-huh. Okay. Take care. Okay. Look after him. Hey, Pastor. Mama. What is it you said you wanted to talk to me about? I hope it's all well. Oh, of course, Mama. Everything is fine. Okay. Mm. So? Um, Mama, I wanted to intimate to you about something which Madame Veru confided in me. What is it? What is it that my generous lady, <laughs> Madame Veru, has confided in me? What does it concern me? Um, Mama, Madame Vero has a son. Okay. And a very successful one at that. I see. Yes, Mama. And that her son is still single, very single. He's yet to be married. Mm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> um, Mama, mm -hmm. ever since Madame Vero laid her eyes on your daughter, Chinasa, I mean, l let's see, let's see. <laughs> Madame Veru believes that your daughter Chinasa will make a very good wife for her son Cletus. Yes, my mom said it. <laughs> what did you just say? <laughs> pastor, Pastor, are you joking? Tell me. You're oh, joking. on the contrary, Mama. I am very serious. Okay, Madame Veru said to tell you that she and her people are very ready to come and officially ask the hand of your daughter Chinasa in marriage the moment your people give the go ahead. <laughs> yes, Mama. Pastor, <laughs> what are you saying? We have already given our, our, our consent. Oh, thank yes. you, Jesus. Uh, that's why the fact that I have not even told my daughter, but I know she won't object. She will not. I pray so. Hey, pray Pastor. So. Mama. <laughs> hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Tell Madame Vero that we are, that let her come. Oh, let her just come. That is fine. Let her come with her people. That is fine. Timo. <laughs> eh? It's okay, Mama. Let's, 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 let's put it in the hands of God. Hey! <laughs> oh. You're blessed, Mama. Pastor, you are blessed too. I hope you kept some back. Yes, Mama. If you will eat now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mama, I forgot to ask you. What was it Pastor Mark wanted to discuss with you? Does it have anything to do with Madame Vera? Mm -hmm. Oh, well. I would say it has. I knew it! It. Because that woman's generosity towards us, I'm suspecting it too. She has an ulterior motive. <laughs> an ulterior motive. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, that is an ulterior motive. My intuition is always accurate. Mama, we need to stop accepting gifts from that woman. It's okay. <laughs> hey. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what are you laughing now? 
Just sign the form. Oh, no, no, you didn't. Why are you this? It's just that eh, you are too suspicious for your own good. That's your point. As for Madame Velo, mm -hmm. you are the reason for her generosity to her family. Yes. Me. Yes. You. How? Mm, let's say that you have found favor in her sight. Mm -hmm. How? You see, Pastor Mark said that Ma, Madame Veros son wants to marry you. Marry me? Oh, yes, marry you. What is it now? Organ? Mama, I lost appetite. Look at this girl. Do you know what? Marry into such a family will mean for us. At least now we have seen that God has answered our prayers. Ne our sufferings are over. See, Pastor Mark said that our son is successful. Isn't that wonderful? Do you know what will happen to our family if you get married into that kind of family? Do you know that? It's going, I mean, our sufferings will be over. That's it, I'm not interested. I've well lost my appetite. What is it? It's food. So, are you going to marry him then? Is it my mother wants me to? To her, this is like the hand of God stretched forth to rescue us from poverty. I can imagine. But what about you, my friend? What do you want? Isn't it what I don't want? Is to continue to see my father suffer like this. Because we don't have money to further his treatment. Isn't it what I don't want? Is to see my mom. Look at her. Suffering. Like we've been suffering for a long time now. Isn't it? That is what I want. And I'm Obi. Isn't I won't lie to you. I love I'm Obi. But I don't see us having a future together. And I cannot deceive him. I can't do that to him. I understand. Listen, I want you to know that whatever you decide is fine by me. And I, as your best friend, will support you to the very end. You know I can't do it without you. I'm going to break ten aki for you now. And who are you looking for? Uh, who are you looking for? My, my name is Chinasa, Madam Vero. Uh, Madam Vero sent for me. You? Oh, so you are the Chinasa, right? The Chinasa. Oh, yes, please. Um, forgive my manners, okay? I should be ushering you in. Come on, come inside. Come. Uh, uh, please, see. None of my mother's guests should be standing outside, so come inside, come yeah, on. You, 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 you are? Oh, my name is Cletus. Oh, okay. <laughs> Cletus. Okay. So, um, how are you? Okay, so... Uh, uh, please, 
Where's your mother? And actually, she went on an errand. She was only back before you know it. Okay? I am sure you're not aware. Aware of what? I mean, there's a... Um, this meeting, this, this, this appointment, this whole arrangement was, um, was for us to meet. Yeah, to know each other. It's okay. Uh, it's alright. I'm, I'm sorry for the embarrassment, okay? You know, you're a very beautiful girl. Janessa, very, very beautiful. Trust me, you are. Thank you, sir. No, Cletus. <laughs> Cletus. The name is Cletus. You know, Janessa, when we get married, it will be awkward for my wife to be calling me, sir. Don't you think so? Oh. Ah. Uh, Mom. Janessa, my dear. You came after all. Yes, Mom. Hey. That's very kind of you. Hmm. I can see that you're, you and my son are getting older. Uh, yes, we are. <laughs> no problem. Both of you, go ahead and keep planning to understand each other. I'll be right back. Welcome. Uh, Jesus, uh, sit down. Uh, Relax, eh? <laughs> you take good care of her, okay? Um, just know that you <laughs> So, chill. So, you want something to chew? Are you sure? I like the way you smile. <laughs> Mr. Kletus. Oh, sorry. Kletus. Why are you stopping the car here? Um, I stopped it because I have something I want to give to you. Mr. Cle Sorry, Cletus, please. I, I don't think I, I want anything now from you. I'm fine. Um, Chinaza, I know everything will be looking too fast to you, okay? But the truth is that I believe it is fit. Yes? See, immediately my mother saw you. She loved you immediately. Immediately I saw you, I knew you were the right girl for me. Really? Yes, really. You see, as strange as it sounds, okay, I cannot be single and searching for as long as I have been, and I don't know when the right woman comes along. Why? Why? Why what? Why have you been searching for so long? I said nothing is wrong with me. There's actually nothing wrong with me if that is what you're implying. No, I mean, no, 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 no. Nothing is wrong with me. I'm sorry. I, I didn't. It came out wrongly. I didn't. I didn't mean it that way. It's okay. It's okay. I. I am sorry. I snapped at you. All right. I mean, um, nothing is wrong with me. I'm okay. Hmm? I got this for you. It's an engagement ring. An engagement ring? But I haven't even said... Shh. Say yes to my proposal. Believe me, you, your parents, and your entire family, you people will never know the name poverty. You will never know it. I mean, think about what I'm saying. Alright? And the next time I see you, 
I want to see you wearing this ring. You know, here. Yeah. I think of my proposal as well. You will never, ever regret it. Adama me, Oh, you are here. Chimo, what is it? I've been looking for you everywhere. And you're not answering all the kwama. Yes, yes, ma. I guess I was I was carried away. You were carried away. <laughs> I guess I can say one or two things while you were carried away. <laughs> you were thinking about uh, uh what is this? It's a ring. Gletus gave it to me. Gletus gave you a ring? You mean he gave you a ring? Chimo! Ah. It's a gold ring. It's, let me see. It's a gold ring! Gletus gave you a gold ring. Yes, Mama. He gave me. He said it, it's supposed to be an engagement ring. Mm -hmm. so I should wear it if I accept his proposal. Then what are you waiting for? What have you been waiting for to slip this uh, ring into your finger? Why? Any? Or are you telling me you passionately love poverty? Any? Mama, it's not like that. What about Amobi? Amobi? Yes. What, Akagi, what is your problem? Who is Amobi? Amobi, he has made his intentions known to me now, and I don't want to hurt him. Hey, 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 Amobi intentions. Who is Amobi? Since Amobi made his intentions or his intentionless intentions clear to you, what has he done for us? Has he brought uh, 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 food on our table? He has not. Because with Akagi, he me. Hey, Lekwanumanya, Lekwanumanya, golden ring. Look at it now, how it fits you. Ne, have you not heard? No, onye buigo, keuneso. Have you not heard that? Have you not? Ah, please. This ring is your own. Wear it. It fits you. Can you Yeah, Hey, Mama. Hold this for me. Mama, this is just a taste of good things I will follow as soon as I and Chinasa get married. Ah. See, talking about getting married. You've already gotten married though. I am telling you, it is the story of how you got married that is being spread all over the place. Really? Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks for putting a smile on my mother's face. No, I I should be the one thanking you for accepting to wear my ring. Okay? <laughs> What is this that I'm seeing? Uh, I'm okay. So, Chinasa, it is true. I heard about this, so I had to rush. Let me come see for myself. Because I never believed you could do this to me, Chinasa. But all that guess was, was actually wrong, Chinasa. Chinasa, how could you? Hold on, hold on. Uh, 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 young lady, come here. What do you think you're going to? Oh, you think I will stand here and watch my wife to run after another man? Uh, excuse me, point of correction. We are not married yet, okay? Chinasa, come! I'm Bobby! Mama, come! I'm Bobby! Wait! Chinasa, you'll be a man! Eh? Chinasa, you'll be a man! Eh? Look at me, you look at me, oh! I'm Bobby, wait now, I'm Bobby, look! I'm Obi, just wait. Let me explain. Okay. What is it? What is it? Just because I don't have money, right? No. Because I'm not wealthy, that's why you chose Madame Veroson over me, right? Of course not. It's not like that. Then what is it, Chinasa? Chinasa, can you tell me? What is it? Why? I'm, see, I'm, I'm, I'm doing this for my parents. 
I'm doing it for, for, my, for my father, my mother. But you're not responsible for, 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 for them. Amobi, I am responsible for them. You shouldn't be it in Asa. Amobi, I am. Who else will look after them if not me? Eh? Amobi, I really wanted to tell you myself. I didn't want you to find out like this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if this hurts you. Stop acting like this now. You're acting like I even made any promise to you. Eh? Oh. Is that so? Ah. Oh. Look into my eyes and tell me. Tell me that you love him. I know you are marrying. You are marrying money. You are marrying that young man because of his money. You don't love him. But I promise you one thing. A time will come when you look for, for love, you will not see it. It's a promise. <laughs> so you are finally coming back to this house, eh? Are you coming back to this house? Eh, Nasa? <laughs> you cannot tell me that you want to be a proverbial daughter that ruined the good fortune coming into the family. Now, Nasa, if you know what is good for you, just do a roundabout turn. Go back to Clayton's house. Go and apologize to him. Yes, go and apologize to him for this, this uh, 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 embarrassment you gave to him here today. Are you still there waiting for me? It's only my home game. It's only my home game. Eh, Biano, no. Biano, it's only my home game. Biano, I'm not here. <laughs> oh my god. You yeah, look right? so beautiful. I can't believe how beautiful you're looking. You're really radiant. Thank you. We're bright radiant on our wedding day now. Right? Yes, you're right. And I can see you no longer have reservations about marrying Cletus. Am I right? <laughs> Babe. You're right. Do you know Cletus showed me what perfect and matured man he is? On the day I thought everything was over, he surprised me. Came back? Yes, I I came back. I needed to apologize to you. Really? Um please. See. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, um, like you said, I acted very possessive. I'm sorry. You are? Yes, I am. You know, I I should have realized that as a beautiful girl that you are, you should have somebody. Oh. Yeah. And I might just want you to forgive me and hope this is not going to, you know, make you change your mind towards our marriage plans. No, of course not. I, I only followed Amobi to explain things to him. He's a very good friend of mine. I, 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 I don't want to hurt his feelings. So you, you're trying to tell me that you and the so-called 
I'm gonna be a good guy. Yeah, you guys don't have anything. He's just a friend. Yeah, he's he's a friend. Just a friend. Yeah, but he never failed to to make his intentions and feelings known to me. Oh, too bad. Um, too bad for him, though. <laughs> You know, now that I, I have you, I'm not going to let you go. I won't I'll ever, ever let you go again. Alright? Mm -hmm. You know I love you, right? Hmm? You no, know you know that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. You mean you really did that? I'm sure the words is an understatement. Oh my, Cletus must really love you. I mean, it's only a man who loves a girl that will do that because he doesn't want to lose the girl that he loves. I know. <laughs> That's why I'm, I'm, I'm happy, I'm excited. Aww. All my dreams are coming to pass. Yeah, right. I must envy you. You almost. Mm -hmm. Girls, girls, get up. It's time. It's time. It's now time for you to officially become Mrs. Clayton. Oh, yes. To marry me. My shoe, my shoe, my shoe, my shoe. Okay. Get it, get it, get it. Okay, let me get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Hey. I've learned so many things in life. Oh, life itself is a lesson. I've been through many ups and downs. So, oh, now I realize that life is a lesson I've learned to pay attention to my conscience I've learned to do what is right though No longer will I be a slave to your selfish desires mm. No longer will I be a prisoner My daughter, we take love. this one and go and show us the man after your house But you choose to play me for a fool I gave you my life I gave you my time But you choose to play me for a fool But now I realize Oh, yeah, put up Be careful, you know it's better than Without him, can't rest, no sleeping. So today we have seen that man, isn't it? It is. Come on, come on. So tonight I finally become a woman. I heard the first time that I was thinking. Well, I hope that is my prayer. It's now or never. I gave you my life. I gave you my time. But you choose to play me for a fool. But now I realize. It's time we get down. I know. I had a lot to discuss with my mother. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm coming. I should have that. Something. What are you doing? And what does it look like I'm doing? I'm packing, of course. You're packing? Yes. You're packing to me? 
So that I'm sorry, okay? I don't know how to tell you this. Tell me what? I must travel tonight. My business abroad needs me urgently and I must go immediately. Well, it, it, it's a wedding night and we just got married. I, I, I know, but I just can't help it. Okay? No, baby, whatever you're going to do has to wait. You can tell them. We just, it's our wedding night. We just got married. They have to wait. I can't wait. Right. I promise you I'll make it up to you as soon as I get back, okay? Come on. Huh? Don't worry, I'll make it up to you, right? I'm going to miss you. Come here. Trust me, I'll miss you. <laughs> when did you say you're coming back again? Oh, I say about a week. But you said... Uh, ah, that's okay, my dear. I know you'll be missing your husband. <laughs> Don't worry. It's just for one week. No. I'll make sure I keep you busy. You won't even know when one week passes. I, I trust you, Mama. I say, I trust Mama. Mama knows how to take care of someone. Yes. Eh? And Mama, make sure my wife doesn't lack anything. Trust me now. I'm going to make her have fun. You know your words reassures me. Yes. All right, darling. Come on. It's um, <laughs> okay now. I'll be back before you know it. Love birds. <laughs> you're going to miss your flight, too. Oh. See that? I, I, I get to get. It's okay now. You're going to miss your flight. Is this rich? Of course not. Oh, yeah, tell me. How was the experience? You have come now. What experience? You know now. Good job. Your wedding night. How was it? It's the first time really all that is cracked up to me. I wouldn't know. Kekwa and Kebu, you don't know. Oh, you don't want to tell me your choir? <laughs> I see that you had so much fun that you are ashamed to tell me, Kwaya. Please see. I Come on. Really... What? You don't have to be shy. Okay, so tell me. How did this shy little virgin behave on her first day? See, there's nothing to tell, really. Nothing. Nothing. What is that there's nothing to tell? I don't understand. Wait, wait, wait. You mean nothing really happened? That you and Cletus didn't. We didn't because he had to travel immediately and we did not. I find it very hard to believe you. Why? It's very unlike men now. I mean, every man would like to get into the skirt of a girl. Not to talk of a brand new chassis wife like you. Hey, this is very strange, Joe. Ah. So, what is so strange about that? You lose. One home village So you want my son to stay back and be doing a cooking with Chinasa? Why his business suffers? Okay? No, um, that's not what she meant. Only shut up! I know what she meant. I know her type. She's one of those prostitutes that move about the whole village looking for innocent. Young women that they will lure into prostitution. Mama, that's a very unfair thing to say. 
I'm not an Akuna Akuna. How dare you talk back at me? Who told you you can talk to me? Who told you that? You stupid prostitute. Now, leave the house. Mama. Ah! Mama, Mama, don't do that now. Mama, she's my best friend now. Mama. Mama. Don't, don't, don't come near me. Leave my house. Don't it's in there. It's in the wait. You, if you don't mind yourself, you'll go with her now. <laughs> Shut my gate for me and get out. Don't you ever come back here. What is it? I just want to apologize about what happened earlier today with my friend. You know, the truth is, you jumped into the wrong conclusion. It is not oh. that. How dare you? How dare you stand and tell me to my face that I jumped into the wrong conclusion about your friend? I can see you've lost all sense of respect. Mama, you don't understand. That girl. Stop me the explanation! I don't want to understand. Now listen to me. I don't want to ever see that girl in this compound again. Yes, and you must not keep friends with people of such characters again. Mama, what did you just say? You had me right. And let me warn you. Better heed my warning or you will live to regret it. Please clear up the place. I'm tired of eating this rubbish food. Good afternoon. You just have to. It's like you're going out. Uh, I, yes, I quickly want to see my parents. And if I didn't come out now, you wouldn't have told me. I'm going no, out. I'd go to your room to look for you, but I didn't find you there. No problem. Send me word to your parents, huh? Okay, mom. Uh, uh, Chinusa. Ma? You can't just go like that. Why don't you go to the store and see some food items for your mother? I'm sure she will appreciate it. Thank you, Mama. Ah, uh, come. Your mother? Tell her Madame Vero gave it to her. Mama? Hmm? <laughs> Thank you very much. Mama, you're so generous. Thank you. I know. Thank you. Just try and come back early. Oh, okay, Mama. Eh? Let me take a full story. Uh, and I'm sure you're not going to visit that your stupid trusted stuff in front, whatever her name is. No, I'm just going straight to my place. Good. Thank you, Mama. Okay, send me well to them, eh? Yes, sir. Papa, how are you? Oh, poor. See, see how it is. He can talk. Mm, yes, he can. He can. Mama, I miss you. <laughs> Trust me, I miss this house. I didn't know I was going to miss this house like this. Oh, it's like that. It's like that. Every one of us did that. Hmm? We all worked hard to make sure that uh, our homes are stable. Mm. It's especially now that your husband is not away. When he comes, we'll see what will happen when he comes back. I hope so. Yes, it well, is like that. Uh, I brought you this from my mother-in-law. I have seen it now. I have seen it. And she also gave too me. many, too many, too <laughs> many of it. She gave me something else to give you. Yeah. 
How? <laughs> How much? 20,000. 20,000 for so the lenu. I think we have money enough now to buy your drugs. Rungo. Thank you. Tell your mother-in-law that I am thanking her. I don't know how to thank her. Eh? That's my in-law. Ogom jiaka metero ngwem. Oge ome. Oh, greet her for me. God will bless her continually. Mm. Okay, okay. That your mother-in-law. Babe, I've told you, don't take it personal. She's a very nice and welcoming woman. I've apologized on her behalf. Yeah? Yes. Did you say nice and welcoming? I'll take your word for it too. Don't worry. You'll realize that when you get to know her better. Yeah? Get to know who better. A woman that called me an akuna kuna. Or weren't you there when your mother-in-law wanted me never to step foot in her house again? No way, my friend. There's no way I'll ever go back to that your house again. It's no good. That's also my house. So you're indirectly saying you're not going to visit me again? Isn't it? Come on now. You're my best friend. And there's no way you will not visit me. It's not possible. Well, I don't perceive it in that way. In fact, she gave me the impression that she would rather you not have friends again. And I wonder why it's like that. Isn't it? Bye-bye. I beg you. See you in my house tomorrow. See you in my house tomorrow. You and your mother-in-law. Have fun. Isn't it? Hmm. You're not serious. <laughs> You look frightened. What is it? Did I frighten you? Of course you did. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to. Who are you? You mean you don't know me? I wouldn't be asking if I did. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. I am not so. Cletus, your husband is my elder brother. My husband's brother. But nobody told me that. Are you that, serious? Yes, no, no, nobody. Okay, should I say? No one likes talking about me. I am like what they call the black sheep of the family. You see? I see. It's cool. From the look of things, it's like you need some help. No, no. Uh, I, I noticed. Don't worry. Let me help you. Okay. Like, mm -hmm. okay, thank you. Yeah, nice to meet you. See you around. Thank you. Beautiful. Mm. You look startled. I hope I didn't startle you. Of course you did. Well, I'm sorry. It wasn't my intentions. And what are you doing here by this time? Why aren't you sleeping? I came down from my room to see a movie. I guess I dozed off. Oh. Okay. this food for me. I don't know how to operate it. Just see if you can teach me. Oh, this is nice. 
You like it? Yeah. It's even has camera. See. Eh? Can I take this off? Yes, no. Yeah, take mm. it. Take it. Well, mommy. How are you, my dear? Fine. Have you greeted myself? Yeah, hi. <laughs> Take me. Please, but Mama. Yes. I'm very curious about. Curious about what? No, so. What about it? He told me you guys call him the black sheep of the family. He said that to you. Yes, for you to have called him that, it means what he did must be really, really big and serious. For Cletus not to have mentioned that he has a younger brother to me. He didn't mention it? He never did. Even you too, he never told me. Really? Yes. Don't mind what everyone else told you. Listen to me. Listen to me, Chinasa. You are still too young. I'm too new in this marriage to start proposing into the affairs of this family. Hmm? Just mind your business. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me see. Okay, so, um... Wait, is it that you don't have clothes or you just um, delight pleasure exposing yourself in this house? How? Does my dressing affect you in any Your way? Your dressing? Or lack of it, you mean? You see, I don't see any reason why this should bother you, since we're practically family. You being my brother's wife and all. <laughs> I just want you to realize that you're not the only one staying in this house and you should have some decency. Is that so? Yes, that is so. Okay, if that is the case, why can't you look me straight in the eyes and tell me that? You know what, I'm beginning to think that you are getting attracted to me. But that's not the case, <laughs> because I like you too. You are one heck of a sexy village girl. Yes, yes. And nobody that calls herself my daughter in law. Eh? Tina, sir! What is it? Did anybody offend you? Why are you shouting? Yes! You are the one that offended me. How dare you? Eh, Tina, sir? How dare you raise your filthy hand on my son, Monzo? How dare you? Oh, Mama, I see that he has run to report already that I slapped him. But he forgot to mention to you what he did to warrant that slap. Mama, it's not so you should direct your anger at all, not me. Is that so? Yes, Mama. What is it that he did that warrants you raising up your fitting hand on him Mama. to slap him? How, how dare you? I am ashamed of saying it. I'm sure when I tell you, you'll also be ashamed of him. Mama, please just help me warn no so. Warn him to be respectful of his elder brother's wife. He should also be respectful of me as a woman. And while at it, he should stop parading himself half naked in this compound. Paradis himself half naked. Eh? Why wouldn't he? Is this not his brother's house? Eh? Are your eyes supposed to see half naked men? Let it not be that you have started uh, following in loss for my son or so, because that will not be accepted. At all, at all, at all. Don't even try it. That's a no go area. Mama, it's still of you to caution also over his too familiar behavior with me. You're calling me names. Too familiar behavior, indeed. Eh? Are you sure you're not the one giving him a uh, 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 common signal? Eh? See, if you dare try this kind of a thing again, if you try it again in this house, eh? In fact, I will send you to your father's house long before your husband Cletus comes back. Nonsense. I, I, I can see you don't have anything to do with yourself. Rubbish.
No, so how dare you sneak on me like that? It, it's not what you think. I, I it's just that I was passing by and I saw your door slightly ajar, so I, I couldn't resist it. You saw my door slightly ajar. Why didn't you pass? If you come close to me, I'm going to scream. And I promise you. Come on, Chinasa. Why are you behaving like a baby? You and I know what happens between a man and a woman. See, I, I, I know you like me. And I, I'm crazy about you too. What is wrong with you? Have you forgotten I'm your brother's wife? Don't you dare come close to me. No, you're, you're my brother's wife. And so what? And so, okay, where is my brother? Missing in action. He should have known better than to leave you here alone. Chinasa, I, I, I know you're a human being like me. I, for, for some time now, you've been yearning for a man's touch. And here I am. Let's do this thing and nobody will find out. Now I see the reason they call you the black sheep of the family. If you come close to me, I'll break your head. Now, so get out! I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. I'll go. Mary, mother of God. You mean your brother-in-law wants to sleep with you? I don't believe this. See, I'm having a hard time believing it. Not even in my wildest dream. Since things are this way, I think you should inform Madame Vero with immediate effects. I'm afraid. I don't understand. Which one is that you're afraid? Babe. Nonso started by parading himself half naked in the house. The next thing I knew, he wanted to touch me and then I slapped him. That's good for him. Don't tell me you regret slapping him. Regret slapping him how? He told his mother that I slapped him. <laughs> she warned me never ever to touch her precious son again. She even called me the daughter of a nobody. Uh, I don't believe this. My God. So, because you are the daughter of a nobody, her son should harass you the way that he likes. Mm -hmm. Eh? Is that it? I don't blame her. It, it is clear to Sibylle that left the night of our wedding for a one week trip that has turned to two weeks. Now we're still counting. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to say. But the way things are, I would advise you that locking your room door at night. Because as Rani as you claim that non so boy is, I wouldn't put it past him if he comes at night when they are rapes the living daylight out of you. Hmm. Hmm. Ah. His brother's wife. Hey. Hmm. So Fred Virgin, you think you're smart? Damn. What nonsense? Huh? Chinasa, mm -hmm. can you explain to me what you mean by locking up your door every night? I have just noticed that for some nights now you, you will lock your door. What is it? Or is it that you think that? Uh, no, sir, I will steal from you, or, or what? what? Is that it? No, Mama, of course not. But Mama, why would you even say a thing like that? Hmm. So what is it now? Ha! <laughs> eh? What has Madame Vero not seen in this life? In my own son's house, what? Okay. Eh? Okay, Mama, for all his worth, I'm sorry. But the, the reason For why... nothing, China, sir! Let this be the last time you will ever try such a thing in this house. Well, what is this, F? I wonder what you think you have that someone will want, want to come and steal. Eh? Ma, I, I'm not locking my room door because I feel someone would come and steal anything from me. I have reasons why I lock the room door. I, I don't want to know what your reasons are. Don't even try to explain to me. Let me just warn you. Try locking your door again. You see what I will do to you? No sense. Look at you. In your father's house, do you have a room? Is it not in the parlor that you sleep on the mat? 
Now you are in my house and you have a room and you, you are behaving like a big girl. Try it again and you see what I'll do to you. Nonsense. Yes, my dear. Uh, sit down. Sit down. Uh, how was the father the last time he went to visit? Any improvement? <sighs> mm. Not much improvement. Nothing has really changed. Well, I have good news for you. Well, does that have anything to do with my father? Of course it does. You see, a healer came highly recommended, but it's really too expensive, very, like 350,000. Mm. Mm. I see. No, my dear, I, I don't think you see. But not to worry. I spoke to your husband, Cletus, about it, and he has agreed that we should take your father there. That you should anything for his in laws. Wait, Mama, that you should. Mama! <laughs> what, what is expensive now? Eh? 350,000. Not to worry. But Mama, how come you didn't mention it to me when we spoke? Really? Hey! Since he has told me, does it really matter? No, no, it doesn't. It doesn't. Mama, you should take my father there. Of course, yes. Oh, <laughs> Mama, why didn't you? It's okay. Uh, just. Get ready. We are going there tomorrow morning. And please be ready in time. Mama, let me go and tell my mother. Yes, okay. Can I? Can I? Go, go ahead. Mama, thank you very much, your mama. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, my love. Thank you for the visit. It's okay. You don't need to worry yourself. Uh, my son, your in-law, Cletus, gave me deposit to pay. I have already paid. So you don't need to bother yourself. The next payment will be after the treatment on his discharge. Thank you so much. It's okay. Thank you so much. I don't know how to thank you. Please help me thank my son in law. Hmm? He has been so generous to me. Ah. <laughs> that is it. Like mother, like son, you know. Oh, you oh, can't that say that. Thank you so much. No problem. Uh, Tina and I will be leaving now. She will be coming from time to time to bring food for you people whenever she can. See, I don't want to stress you. Eh? I don't. I can always prepare some food and bring so that we will eat. <laughs> Mama, it will not be stressful, okay? I'll be coming to give you and Papa food from time to time. Okay, if you say so. Oh. Yeah, My she God. can. My God. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Thank you. Oh, take care. Say, no, it's okay. It's okay. We'll always do our best. Just take care of him, okay? Yeah. Uh -huh. Bye. Bye. Chinasa. I don't believe you. So you mean your mother-in-law scolded you for locking your bedroom door at night when it's obvious you have a random Shh, 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 stop shouting. Mm -hmm. I didn't tell you this to tell anybody. Eh? Anyone who hears this now will think I committed a very serious crime. They won't know it's just locking my room that night. Eh? My goodness. I don't believe this. I don't believe this too. She claims that my actions simply means that I'm indirectly calling them thieves. Herself and her son. That they will come in the middle of the night to steal my things. Please, what do I have that they want to steal? <laughs> oh, dear, boo. You and I know that is not true. But wait, too. Have you told her about your fears? I do, do. She does not want listen to me anymore. Especially now that her son is, is around. Anything that I do now is wrong in her sight. She does not, nothing I do is right to her. Hmm. I see. Well, if you ask me, I will tell you that that your mother-in-law is up to something. The what is what I don't know. But one thing is certain, I never liked that woman. I have never liked that, Madam Vero. Mm. Hey! Mm. Mm. 
You are telling me that your mother-in-law said she's coming to take your father somewhere where he will be getting better treatment. Yes, Mama. She even said it was Cletus who suggested it. Oh, Cletus, Cletus. My great son-in-law. <laughs> he has such a large heart. Bizoko, you didn't make a mistake marrying him. Bizoko, you didn't. Mama, are you sure? I am not only sure, I know it. I know it. Eh? Now tell me, which in-law will ever do what he is doing for us? Eh? Look at it now. No. Hmm? When is he even coming back? Mama, I don't know. He's been postponing and right now, eh? I'm tired. I'm tired. I don't even care anymore. Don't say that. Come to think of it, I... Your face, your face is sending a wrong signal to me. Is anything the matter? Ne? Nasa. Nasa. Is anything bothering my daughter? Tell me, you are my daughter. I'm your mother. I, I, I know what I can do. Mama, Mama, sis, let me not bother you with my own. Eh? It is not. Oh, no, Mama, I, I believe when Kletus returns, everything will be fine. Nasa. Nasa. He's not a bother. Please tell your mother what the problem is. Mama, I am fine. Look at my teeth. <laughs> I am <laughs> oh, fine. Okay. <laughs> that is what I want. You I have know, to be you, fine that is for what you me. Want to see. <laughs> yeah, be fine for me. Uh -uh. Hey. wrong if he crept into your room last night to sleep with you? Is he not your, bro uh, your husband's brother? What is wrong in the brother trying to help out his brother uh, uh, to do his uh, business? Uh, after all, Cletus, my son, bought and paid for you. Nonsense. Mom, I just told you now that Nonso almost raped me last huh? night. And this is all you have to say. Mama, it's not true. Don't mind her. Don't mind what she's saying. If she hadn't been the one giving me green light, I wouldn't have tried sleeping with her. She was the one that seduced me. I don't mind her, Joe. This hopeless prostitute. She thinks she can deceive me with this air of innocence that she uses in deceiving my son, Cletus. Rubbish. I know you, you have been rotten. 
my your son married me a virgin. And I remain a virgin waiting for him to come back to make me a woman. <laughs> virgin Maria. Virgin Mary. <laughs> oh. See, just go and thank your stars that you did not destroy Nonsu's Akurongwa. Reproductive uh, organ. Otherwise, eh? Hey, I would have dealt with you. You would have seen what I would do to you. Eh? See? You would have seen my other color, Chinasa. Mama. Rubbish. Mama, why do you all of a sudden hate me so much? Mama, what have I done to offend you? I hope I'm not the one you're asking such stupid questions. Akwabura, Mama. Eh? Rubbish. You should be happy that somebody like Nonsu, my son here, even opted to sleep with a stupid, useless, dirty village girl like you. Uh. Hey. Cletus, leave whatever you're doing and come back here. Cletus, if you don't return, I am going back to my father's house. Leave whatever you're doing and come back now. You think I'm joking, Cletus? Ah! Why? You little trap. You have to call my son to gossip about me. Who do you think you have to give my son ultimatum? You think if you leave now, my son Cletus will not find another woman to marry. <laughs> Do you even know how many he had already married before you came in? Um, what, what did you just say? <laughs> you mean Cletus has been married before? Did I have what I my mouth when I said that? Huh? Anyway, I know you value this marriage very much, Pichinasa. Because this family has been of tremendous help to your family. So, behave yourself so you won't live to regret it. Very sorry things didn't work out as planned. It's really regrettable. You are nothing but a charlatan. So better just take off that grin on your face because it's worthless. Okay, um, goodbye. I'm going to miss you. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, just go, eh? Go so you won't be late to where you're going. Of course. Hmm? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I think you really have to come back immediately because things didn't really go the way we planned. Yes. Just hold on. Where do you think you're going? I'm going to my parents. Really? Who told you you can do that? Mama, I'm not aware I have to take permission from you to go to my parents. Let it be known to you that you have to do that. You think I don't know that you intentionally want to go there with swollen, teary eyes to gossip me with your poor, old, dirty parents? Mama, look. My parents may be old, dirty, and poor, but they are honorable. They will never descend so low to do what you did. You're talking to me. 
How dare you? You insolent and ungrateful girl. You've just crossed the line. You will pay. Chinasa, you will pay. Because I'm not going to forgive this insult in a hurry. I swear to God, you will pay. You will pay for this insolence. Nonsense. Oh, Mama. <laughs> Welcome, my son. Thank you, Mama. I Thank you very much. So oh, I missed it too, oh, Mama. Oh, I missed you. Oh, I'm gonna miss you a lot. I miss you too, Mama. <laughs> I miss you so much. So, Welcome. Mama, how have you been? Good. As you can see. Get those hands off. Get the filthy hands off me, you tramp. My son, come and eat the food your mother prepared for you. Oh, my trust you. I know what you can prepare for me. <laughs> Oh my nose will have to make lizard for me to eat. <laughs> Chinasa, how could you? Huh? How could you? I, mean, I, I just can't believe I, I, I can't believe that you can stoop so low as to seduce my my, my younger brother. So how could you? Cletus, I didn't do any of such thing. You have to believe me. I I would never. Never do you think like that? Liar! So what are you saying? What are you trying to say here? That my mother is lying? Oh. That my mother is lying against you? Know, she's a bloody liar! I wish Nosa were here. Nosa would have told you by himself. I used to think this girl is reserved though. I never knew she's like one of those village girls, eh? Mama, Mama, Mama. They are all the same. Mama, why are you doing this now? You, you know, I, I, I didn't even know what you're accusing me of. Nosa was the one who tried to rape me. What did you say? You dare mention the name of my son. Mama! Go that time! I didn't do it, Cletus, 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 I swear to Almighty God. So I it? Me. Me and Nosa, we did it. Isn't it? Me and Nosa, we did it! They did it, right? Both of them. Is that what you're trying to say? Both of them. Mama was Stop. holding his leg. That's what you're trying to say. I thought you were reserved. So can you come trust all those village girls? No, I cannot, no longer trust them. You won't believe what they do. This one she has fully prepared. Cletus, I beg you in the name of God. You have to believe me. I didn't do any of those things your mama accused me of. That means my mother is a liar here, right? You know, Chinasa, I somehow I, I find it very difficult to believe all this. I understand. I know. I know it's your mom's word against mine, and I have nothing to vindicate myself but but the proof of my virginity. What? It's just, I have never. I've never met with another man. I've kept myself for you. And if you think I'm lying, make love to me. I don't see any improvements in Papa. Ah, my dear, that was what the healer said. He said the healing process of the uh, stroke is really very gradual. But thank God that I know that he's going to be healed. I'm so optimistic. Yeah. 
What is it? Tell your mother. What is it that is making you so sad? Oh, Guinea. Mama, I think I made a mistake marrying Kletus. To Fiawa. To Fiawa. Marrying Kletus can never be a mistake. Andonia, it can never. Mama, my mother in law accused me of, of seducing my, my husband's younger brother to sleep with me. She lied against me. And now she has made my husband so hate me. My husband doesn't like me anymore. Ha. <laughs> no, I don't believe this. Oh. Madame Vero, the Madame Vero that I know. The Madame Vero that loves us and has been doing so many things for us. No, I don't believe you. W will I be lying to you? Will I be lying to you, Mama? <laughs> I said my husband doesn't like me anymore and I don't think I can continue with this, Mama. <laughs> will you shut up? Will you shut that mouth up? What do you mean by that? Eh? I see you, you are getting crazy. Eh? Nasa. Here. Nasa, can you listen to yourself? Can you just listen to yourself? Now see, you are the only child I have. Are you sure you did not offend her? Are you sure you did not do anything that made her to, 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 to do that? Are you totally innocent? Are you? Mama, even you, you don't believe me. My own mother. Hey, Mama. <laughs> Nasa, I don't know what you're saying. I really don't know what you are saying. But all I want to say is that you are my only daughter. No daughter of mine, you are the only one, can put shame on me. Mba. See, you better go and look for what the problem is. Go and look for what the matter is and mend it. Go and fix your marriage, my friend. What's your problem? Nonsense. <laughs> Everything is fine. Okay. Listen, where do I run to? Eh? Where? My mother-in-law does not believe me. My mom said that she won't look for what is wrong with my marriage and fix it. How do I do that? I'm very sorry. You don't deserve this, believe me. It hurts to see you like this, trust me. You don't deserve such wickedness. To even think that things will get better when Cletus returns. It has worsened. It has worsened, isn't it? That one has not even touched me since we got married. He's rejected me based on his mother's lies. I don't believe you. So you mean you've not slept with your husband till now? Isn't it? Will I lie to you? Isn't it? You're my best friend now. Will I lie to you? Chinasa, if you ask me, I will say that there's something going on in that house that they don't want you to know about. I don't understand. Okay. First of all, it was a business trip. Then he returns. He returns. He refuses to touch you based on his mother's claim. Bia? Are you sure that that's your husband is man enough? Ibiakwa. Which one is man enough? Mm -hmm. Man mm -hmm. enough in the sense that Iyeya on Arukoro of Fuma. Yes. Because it's only an impotent man that will hide behind an excuse instead of him proving himself a man. Babes, shine your eyes oh. There's more to this than meets the eye. You're nothing but a loose girl. What do you think you're doing? I I want. I I, I want. Chinasa, you should be ashamed of yourself. Okay? You should be ashamed of yourself.
is in me. I'm so ashamed of myself. How so? He's your husband, isn't he? You have every right to try to get him to make love to you. You can't die in silence now. But how do I do that now? Eh? How do I do that? Every time he looks at me, I see the disgust on his face. <laughs> Maybe what you're saying isn't disgust. On the contrary, it might be the shame of him trying to bring himself to perform like a man. Please, what's the meaning of that? Hmm. Isn't it, I've told you before. Don't you know Cletus? Does he look like an impotent man? Eh? And me, I'm even thinking he has a concubine outside. Is why he's rejecting me. That doesn't make sense, my friend. I mean, if it's true, then why did he get married to you in the first place? Why? Why waste his time? Mm -hmm. Ooh, see who we have here. <laughs> Hi, Amubi. Hey, Amubi. Hi, Chinasa. Uh, how are you now? As you can see, I'm doing good. What about you? I hope you're enjoying your marriage like you were expected. Ah, oh yes, no. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> <laughs> so. <laughs> Chinasa, what are you doing here? Is this your father you said you were going to visit? I had always known you were up to no good. Is that not the girl I said you should never hang out with anymore? This village tramp! Bia, 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 Madam Vera, whatever you are being called. Don't try that nonsense with me, are you hearing me? <laughs> Don't try that nonsense with me, oh! Don't, don't even try it! See, I'm not in your house. Neither are my chinas are here that I can treat anyhow. If you try any rubbish with me, I'll beat you my ah, Nonsense! Is eh? What is this? I should run from this place because of you. Should I run away because of you? It? Is it? Am I the one you're talking to? Yes! Who this village maker? What can you do? What can you do? I don't blame you. I blame Chinasa. Hang out this Mbeke. Oh, you sneaked out of the house to come and meet with your village boyfriend, isn't it? Mama, no! I, 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 I came to see Zine and he was just passing. Mama, be there, you were just passing by now. Oh, shut up. You know I'm still a child now. I don't know my left or my right, isn't it? Mama, he was just passing by. I, I, I went to see Papa. And on my way, I saw his in on the road. I just... There's no point. There's no point kneeling down and begging. Don't worry. We'll meet at home. Mama. Mama, please. I, I swear, I cannot... As for you that want to meet me, I can see you are one of those that beat your parents up, eh? Thank you. <laughs> eh? Thank you very much, ma. Try it. In fact, after now, we see what happened to you. Nothing can happen. I will beat you. Local champ. Thank you. Rubbish. What? Isn't you have what? killed me? What? Isn't it you have killed me? She thinks she can talk to me anyhow. Isn't it you have killed me? Oh, isn't it you have killed me? Isn't it? Isn't it you said you beat my mother? Uh -huh. And so? Isn't it you have killed me now? Why is the way she was calling me a tramp? Isn't it you have killed me now? And where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? Is it easy in this place? I can explain. You can explain? Chinasa, what do you want to explain? Huh? What exactly do you want to explain? That you left your matrimonial home in presence of going to see your parents? Instead you went to see your lover? No, I, I went to hate in this place. No, that's a lie. Who's lying here? A bloody liar. A prostitute that is what you are. You! A bloody liar. That same boy, is it not the same boy Mama saw you with? Is it not? That same boy that made you insult me! Oh, you still went back to him? No. You went back to him because I cannot give you what you want. I went, I went to see. You, 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 you,
的事儿。Can I say, will you ever forgive me? Please, I'm sorry. I, I don't know what came over me. I've, 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 I've just been jealous. Okay. Please. See, after what Mama told me about your your escalation.